God so loved the world. To continue Friday. I'm now at Stone Motorway Service Station. This again would be a super location for just meeting. You know, it's easy to get here on the M6 and so on between Manchester, Liverpool, Birmingham, Scotland, London, England. Anyone could come. They're all welcome. They're all welcome. All the facilities laid on. You know, food and water and drink and all that. It's got a lake and stuff. It's a nice service station. Do a panorama. Duck stuck in. That running water's nice. The flowing water, the sound of a fountain. It's peaceful. It's a nice spot. See? I wouldn't mind the business, I'm sure. <laughs> and then a nice, you know, service station. It's a good spot. So where's the sun? I'll go down here, mate. It'll be stained into this. So we need to uh, sit. On the wobbly side there. See if we can't pop her up. Ho ho ho, there we go. Ooh. Right, there we go. Right, well now, here's the thing. So I mean, it's so obvious. Yet again this morning, I meet a, a chap who's got a lovely German Shepherd dog, XRAF, retired at the age of 50, but 33 years service, so he started at 16 and a half. Or he puts God occasionally in his box on a Sunday, if he's lucky, at Easter perhaps. You know, he thinks I'm an old tramp. Oh, you're leaving under the arches. What if they nick your computer? Sod the computer. <laughs> I'm not my computer. I mean, I've had cars. I've had all sorts. I'm like old fat Domino, for heaven's sake. I've had six Lincolns, five Cadillacs, three T-shirts, four... Uh, I've had all that. More than enough, thanks. I had two big properties in France. I tried to have a welcoming place there. This flat farm I'm after. 650,000 quids worth, lovely big house, bar. we live in the barn at the back of the chapel and so on. You know, I need a million for that, but so what? That's not the point. The main church, St. Michael's and St. Wolfad, in stone, gets attended by, you know, basically, a few elderly people. Mostly. That's the point. The Baptist Church down at Risingbrook, now on the other hand, south of Stafford, is very well attended by a broad range of people, young and old. It's got a working cafe there, 10 till 2, Monday to Friday. So people just come in, but it's obviously the church. You know, it's, so there we are. Whereas the Church of England is dead. The national average attendance, people have asked what is their religion or Church of England, C of E or whatever, but the t attendance figures were somewhere around 5% the last I knew about it. Going to church occasionally is not being a Christian. And putting God in his box, you know. This is, this is not what Christianity is about. Christianity is a living thing that goes on every moment of our lives. Sleeping, waking, whatever, you have dreams. This is the whole point. One is tuning in to God the whole time. Whatever that means. I met someone there at the bridge where I stay in stone, very spiritual person, 42 year old, works with the homeless, I'm afraid I can't remember her name at the moment, but, you know, she has dreams. She hears her ears popping and she thinks she's talking to Christ, for heaven's sake. Well, that, you know, that's where the psychiatrists step in and say, hello, 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 this is interesting. What you want, girl, all right? Right, I want to do another one of these, okay, I just feel, right, I'll be 20, uh, 50 for 23 tomorrow, that's Theodora. Oops, she slipped in again. I'll be 53 years old tomorrow. What a battle, thank you, happy birthday to me. <laughs> <laughs>